All right, third benefit that you will not see anywhere else at this level is the revenue share plan that the company provides. And so this does get a little bit complicated. If you want to spend more time and deep dive into this, I'm happy to do that. But as an overall general explanation of this, when you bring an agent into the company, the company is going to compensate you for that because there are no regional owners, franchise owners that have to recruit. There are no paid recruiters or headhunters or brokers that are paid to recruit. The growth of the company is purely organic agent to agent. And the company is going to compensate you pretty handsomely for growing the company. And so what this looks like is there's a seven tiered level system and what the company's intent is. And again, this is important to understand. This is revenue share. It's not profit share. There are other companies that may be do doing profit share where after all the expenses in their market center and their franchise are paid, they divvy up some of the profits to the agents. It's not a significant amount of money. Anybody who's been a part of that will tell you it's not life changing. This can be life changing. And so this is revenue off the top. So the 16,000 that the company takes in splits, they dedicate half of that, 50% of that to go back to the agents who have helped grow the company. And so it's a significant amount of money. And if you look at the breakdown here, the way it works is there's two different ways that you, that you get passive income off of the agents that you help recruit and bring to the company. And it goes seven tiers down. So not just the ones that you directly bring into the company, but the ones that they bring into the company and the ones that they bring into the company, you have the opportunity to benefit from their production out of the company share, not out of the agent share. And how this works is, is there's two types of passive income. There is the expansion share and then there's the exponential share. And so the exponential share is the amount the company will give you based on you need a certain number of qualifying agents in order to unlock every tier. So on the front line, so agents that you directly sponsor zero to four, every agent that you directly sponsor, you will get three and a half percent of their adjusted gross commission income until they cap. So once they cap, then, then you will stop getting that, that income, but it could, it can be up to $2,800 a month if they are $2,800 a year, if they cap. So it's a significant amount of money per agent. Once you get five to nine agents, you unlock the second tier. And so any agent that your frontline agent brings in, you will get 3.8% of their adjusted gross commission income. And that can be $3,200 a year if they cap. And so this goes on all the way seven levels deep. You have to bring in 10 to 14 to unlock the third tier. And as you go down, you have to bring 40 plus in to be at four and a half percent to get on that seventh level tier. But say you don't necessarily bring in all the agents, you have more agents on your third and fourth tier, but you don't have 10 plus agents on your front line. The company will give you a small percentage, an expansion share of their production. So you get paid on every single level, no matter what. It's much more significant if you are unlocking the exponential share, but this can turn into a significant amount of money over time. And if you're a good agent and you're good to work with and people want to join what you're a part of, this is naturally going to grow. You don't have to put a lot of intentional energy into this. If you do, it can grow much faster, but there's definitely agents all across the country making 10 plus thousand a month. There are some making six figures a month off of this because they've grown an organization so large that the company sees the value in that and will, and will reward you significantly for it. So huge benefit. Not everybody takes advantage of this, but if you are going to be attracting agents to the company, you will be awarded for it. And this is a huge benefit you won't see anywhere else. And it's definitely an exit strategy from real estate where you don't have to sell, keep selling houses because the house that you sold last year, you don't get paid on today, but the agent that you attract from last year will pay you year after year after year, as long as they are productive. So again, agents have to produce, it incentivizes us bringing agents into the company and helping them be productive. And it really supports the culture of collaboration and support that you don't really see anywhere else. Super cool model. If you want to get deeper into it, I'm happy to talk to you about that.